Hey there, QuickBooks users. Hope you are all doing great today. We've got a special tutorial which would be handy for business owners or accountants who need to manage multiple companies or entities within the QuickBooks online platform. I am very much excited to show you how to add another company to your QuickBooks online account. As always, if you're new here, a warm welcome to our community and it'll be much appreciated if you hit that subscribe button just do it now not later now and ring the notification bell icon so you never miss out on our fantastic content now the purpose of um adding another company to your qbo account is to streamline and simplify the management of multiple businesses or entities within a single centralized platform this feature serves several important purposes number one basically the efficiency you know what obviously managing multiple companies separately can be time consuming and logistically uh, challenging so by adding another company to your quickbooks online account you can efficiently switch between entities without the need for separate logins or software installations which is a drag honestly now, managing different businesses or projects within a single platform helps you to allocate your time more efficiently. And um, it gives a unified user experience, provides a consistent user interface and experience across all other companies. It gives you a seamless data entry, centralized user, user access, you know, scalability and all of that stuff. Now, before you can add another company to the QBO, all you got to do is type, you, you can actually, you, you cannot add it, add it here. You have to do it manually. So all you got to do is go to a QuickBooks pricing. Hold on. All right. Oh, where is the pricing? There you go. If you uh click on this, uh, uh, pricing you will be uh given this option which is a simple start essentials and the plus now you will be <clears throat> you have to uh check which which company are you going to add depends really on the, your usage your needs your wants so you have uh, several options here for a uh, free 30-day trial because we already have uh an account we might as well ask for the training purposes only. We might wanna uh, uh, check the free thirty day trial. Then you will be um, you will be uh, you will be given this information uh, on set the email address of the company that you are you wanted to, to incorporate with the first and last names of the enemy and whatnot. And then after that, after you're creating your information, all you got to do is just add it to your main account. And just like that, that easy, right? You can now seamlessly manage multiple companies or entities within your QuickBooks online account. It's a fantastic feature if you ask me for business owners or accountants juggling multi uh, multiple ventures. And once again, guys, thank you so much if you found this tutorial very helpful. Don't be shy, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and if you have any suggestions for uh, future content, just put it in the comment section. And don't forget to always subscribe for more QuickBooks Online tutorials. Thank you for watching, and I'm gonna see you again on the next video.